probably close. Big buckle thing. What's that? It's a big male. Oh, yeah. Or it's not that big, but no, it's pretty big. Probably close to 10. I think it's a big male. All right, you ready, Papa? Pretty big to me. Yeah, he's pretty big. <laughs> Tell me when you want me to nail him. I can't get uh, Yeah, yeah, one, here, here. Pop out here. I got. I'll, t I'll do it. I'll do it. I got it. Come here. No, get over here. Oh no, no, no! Get away from that anchor. Come on. Get in that. There he goes. That's a big one. Yeah. <laughs> That's a lot bigger than I expected. <laughs> He's a <big> nice. <laughs> Yeah, it's a big male. Very cool. That might be the one we saw right here. <laughs> Definitely. All the time. Seriously. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Well, that's a good first fish of the day. Yeah. All right, what's going on, guys? So we are here with my grandpa, uh, and we got our first king in the morning. It's a big buck. Take him out, show him off. Nice fish. Oh, he's feisty. Oh. So that was on that blue crankbait that I've been doing pretty good on with. It's a real nice fish. Nice stocked fish. So you want to keep them? Oh yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna keep them. Cook them up for dinner tonight. Nana will love it. Nana will love it. I'm doing here from the scene is this is my own cured stuff. Uh, I make this stuff myself. We need to do like a couple day process. If you want to see how I make this, uh, I'll be happy more to show you guys. Just let me know down in the comments. So basically, I just take a little little chunk of that right here. It doesn't have to be too big. And then what I take here is I have what I call a uh, egg loop knot. And then I take my eight, what's called an egg loop knot. And this was this tie knot that has a loop right here. If I can actually get it for you. Just like so. And you take your skein and you put it inside there. And you close it up like so. So you can see like that. And then it dangles like that in the water. And the majority of the time, the fish will just eat the entire thing. Sometimes you just wrap it around like that. These berries will fall off. It's not the big, the biggest thing in the world. So you got like that. And then usually what I like to do is I usually set my uh, bobber afloat about six feet down, depending on where I'm fishing. Because I'm fishing uh, six to seven feet of water right now. And let's get a nice little cast like so. And there we go. Usually you want to try to put the eggs right in front of the fish's face. And a lot of these fish are sitting right now currently in that upper water calm. So they're sitting from like 8 to 5 feet, the majority of these fish. So that's why I just said it right there. So yeah, let's just do that. Papa, can you reel in this line here? Re reel, reel this one in. This is a decent fish. What's on this? A bobber? Or no, it's a crankbait. Here, here, here. Actually, come, come over me. Come over me. Yeah, come yeah, over yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. This is a good fish. Where is he? You're right here. You're right here. You're good. You're right there. Here, go over me. Go over me. Oh, 
big one, I think. I think so too. I haven't even seen it yet. Papa, can you get this other rod? Yep. Right behind, it's on this chair here, and just reel this in. Papa, I, I need you to reel this line in. Huh? I need you to reel that in. Reel what in? The line, that line on that rod. Come over I didn't me. Know there was a line on it. Yeah, no, come oh, over I'm me. Sorry. No, you're good. Just come over me. It. Oh, it's stuck in the trolling motor. It's stuck in the trolling motor, Papa. It's stuck where? On the trolling motor, so just come down. Oh, yeah. No, you're good. You're actually good. All right, that's in. Uh... Yeah, yeah, you're good. This is a nice fish. This is a really nice fish. I haven't even seen the bobber in a while. There's the bobber. So he's six feet behind that. I'm gonna go over you. Yep. I'm oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. Okay. Yep, you got it. Nice. Oh, 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 oh it's a big female. Look at it spin all its eggs out. Oh my god. <laughs> oh Jack, you are so lucky. I, I don't want oh, to no, let yeah, go you're good, you're good, you're good. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I got her. I got her. You got it? Yeah. That's a big female, Papa. Ah. Give me a pull. Oh, she's bleeding, so she's gilled, so we gotta keep her. Plus she's got more eggs. Um, that's probably fifteen. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much for the net job. Oh, that's freaking awesome. <laughs> yeah, seriously. I got plenty of it. What's going on, guys? Third fish of the day. Came on skein. Beautiful fish here. Big female. Probably close to, I don't know, 70 pounds. She's kicking all our eggs out. We're going to try to get her all cleaned up, bleed her out, and try to keep some of these eggs if we can. They're all loose, though, so. Hey, third one. Pretty good. Boat all unloaded, up to the car, all good. Just finished our day, caught some good kings, get this, get, got some good action. Might come out here again later tonight, get that evening bite, but morning bite was success. success. So keep cracking at it. We'll hopefully put some more fish away tonight. I'm gonna have to go around you, Papa. Yeah, hold on. Where's that other bobber? Did you bring that other bobber in or no? I did. Hold on. 
Oh, I see it's right there. If you could just bring that in. You still got them? Yeah, I still got them. It's gonna, still gonna be a bit. You're gonna, you're okay. Bring it in or not? Yeah, 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 yeah. Bring that, bring that bobber in. Oh, look at that! Is that him? Yeah. Oh my god. He's a nice fish. Yeah. It's hard to see. You really need a headlight. Yeah, I've got one. I'll put it on after this fish. I'm skiing yet again. Yeah. Take your time. Yep. Now we we should be okay. He almost took the rod in. Huh? He almost took the rod in. In the water. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> okay, get on. Don't go by the things. Getting good and tired. He's a big one. Yeah. I don't know if you can see him. Definitely just as big as the others, I can tell you that much. Good. Oh, there's the bobber. Well, nope. I saw waves. There he goes. Flash. This is this is a big fish. Don't step on your little thing. No, I see, I see. Yeah, you're good, you're good. Alright, Bobber's coming up soon. There's Bobber. I see the Bobber. Oh, there he is. Oh my you god. Saw him. Yeah, he's a monster. Might be 20. Yeah. Bobber's right here, Papa. Yeah, oh, we might that. be we might be able to get him. Oh, he's, oh. oh shoot. Hold on, hold on, hold on. He's not happy. Come around the other side. Take your time. I am, I am, I am. Yeah, I, I know. I'm just afraid we're going to... I don't know. Yeah. Oh my god, this guy's got no... I think it's a big female. I'm not feeling know. a lot of head shakes. Doesn't matter. Yeah. Okay, we might be able to get her here. Here she comes. Yeah, maybe. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. Alright. Yeah, track pop track pop Oh, no. Oh, one more time. Don't lunge at her. I'll just literally just put her right in your net. Huh? Don't try to lunge at her. I'll just put her right in your net, you know? Don't watch her. Oh, gosh. Getting pretty tired. Just let her yeah. tire it off. All right. Next pass. Coming this way. Yeah, you can do it. You can do it. Yeah, we got her. Oh, that's, that's all of 20. Uh, I don't know, actually. That's a big female, though. It's a big fat one. I'm that is sure. a big female. Oh my god! <laughs> nice. <laughs> She's got a fish business. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah. We're a little past seven. Fish was scan again. Night shift after our morning shift that was a very big success, and this night is now a very big success. Yet again. We're gonna keep her, make some more cure, skein out of her, and keep her meat and she will go full of eggs. It's amazing. So, yeah, 
Mike's going to be here for a little bit longer, but we'll call it a night pretty soon. It's getting pretty dark and windy and cold, so. All right, cool. How's it going, everyone? We're back in the garage now. Uh, got the bow all stored away, all cleaned up. Um, about to go eat some food, go eat some salmon that I've caught. Uh, we had a really good day. Caught four nice fish, three quality ones. We got tons of eggs for future adventures. Um, these eggs were, I cured uh, as soon as I got home. So here we have two different types of skein product. Actually this is, so loose eggs with no skein on it. There's no, they're all loose and they can move around freely. So we'll be we're using those for uh, egg sacks and we'll most likely use these for um, fishing, uh, ice fishing this year. And then we have our cured skein in this bag here. And basically we'll let these sit for three days and we'll use them pretty soon. Um, if you want to see how I cure these eggs, just uh, drop a comment down below and I'll be happy to show you guys. Um, they've been working for me this entire season. I've been catching tons of fish on them uh, and I plan on catching more uh, even later uh, and even into the winter and for future, future years as well. Um, so basically this is just a send off for, for the day. Hopefully we can get back at it next weekend. The fish might start disappearing here pretty soon, but we'll see how it goes. So have a great week. I'll see you next time.